So it's Nancy today, toothless today again. Well, I have a lot of things that need to be done here. I need to, I need to put that board, I need to fasten it to the wall there so I can put that over there. Those are glazes I'm preparing. This needs to be screwed on to under there for a basket. These have to be glazed. And these pumpkins I got in the, they were in the compost, not the compost, what is it called? The um, brush pile at the dump. So after Thanksgiving or Halloween, people just chucked them. So they need to be cooked up, especially this one because it's, it's cracked. So I shall, I shall show you how I'm going to cook it. So this room is a bit of a mess because I'm trying to do all these things at once. We had snow today, so I have all my mittens out here ready to... And the ice seems to be going in a slightly curved direction. That's just not exactly what the plan was. seeds are edible. So you're best to collect them. If you're careful, you can get them out of the, the interior stuff. Okay, so then now you see where it was cut open, there's a bit of mold there, so I'm going to throw that away. I was thinking I would get some of my pottery in the kit. I was, um, I really have compost. So I thought I would work today at getting my, um, pottery all nicely trimmed up and it's dry. I just spin it, you know, wax it in. And get it into the kiln. And then while it's firing, fire it tonight, while it's firing, I will um, make soap. Trying to get things ready for Christmas. We've already had Thanksgiving, thank goodness, that would be awful to have Thanksgiving so close to Christmas. So, so I have to get all my bowls made. Okay, so this is ready to cook. You can just put it upside down. 
upside down and put it in the oven and bake it. So when you bake your pumpkin, you put it upside down in the oven. from the membrane because if you don't the membrane dries with them and it's harder to get it out when it's dry. Willem, could you turn off the hot water heater? I had it on through the night. Since having a hot water heater going through the door. And if you use hot water, it'll replenish it and you end up paying higher bills. Our, our hydro bill. It's already off. Oh, good. Thank you for checking that for me. Our hydro is now priced according to time of day. The best time is the highest time is from 11 to 7, I believe. That's the most expensive time. So from 7 to 7 at night is the cheapest. So that's when I'll fire my kiln. But I'm really kind of unsure about the whole kiln because I've got plaster. There was a bit of plaster I found in some of my clay. And I don't know if it's in all of the clay or, you know, what if I put one thing in and it wrecks everything? But I might as well fire them all together so that I don't ruin another batch. So everything could explode in the kiln and be useless. I don't know which pieces have it in. Well, if it explodes, will it only ruin what's on that shelf? Or will it ruin things on other shelves too? So you take these and you dry these seeds. And then, uh, then you, um, you, pick, you roast them or like when I was young. There's more guck inside the pumpkin than I could leave. Maybe it's a variety of me. Oh dear, is this a GMO pumpkin?
for now. Because this is like a bowl, I could cook it like this and the water will uh, pool in the middle. Or I can turn it upside down and put it in a bowl. And let the water all run into the bowl. But as you can see, that's not going to fit. So I might as well just cook it right side up. That was a long way to show you a very simple thing, wasn't it? Bye!